YouTube, what's up? How's it going? Forgive. How are you guys doing? Good, I hope. I had to go in the house and get some nice hot tea. There's no alcohol in it this time, so that's a bit of a bummer. But it's still good hot tea, so need it. How are you tonight? Are you ready for love, marriage, goodness? Here's your apple, sweetie. Let's get you cut in half. All right. There's your beautiful stars in there. Everybody wants to see the stars. So cool. Let's see. Okay. Let me get the initials right. So I did the double exposure because I'm binding you guys together in marriage. I still think I should I should get my license and marry people. Let's see. So this is for for LG. LG, this is for you. All right. We're going to start out with putting some love oil on the apple. I'm just going to let that sit there and soak up that and I'm going to write your I'm actually going to write your petition on this um, because I already have like well I have your names and everything I already wrote all over it um, earlier but I want to I want to write a few more things on here and you don't want you said you didn't want the obsession part because you don't want them going cuckoo so um, I'm just going to do um, the love binding marriage. It's so hard for me to change my routine up a little bit, but I will still say some of the same things that I say with the obsession part. Okay. See the name. Show me the names. Okay, now I'm writing your name over the top of his name.
Okay, so I have it. That part's done. Then I'm going to turn this clockwise. And now I'm going to write what I want all over the top, all over it, okay? Love, marriage. Wedding ring. I'm listening to you. Loyalty. Cherish. Very nice. Why are you saying mean things? Who are you? If you have nothing nice to say, then you need to leave. Or I will have you removed. Only loveys in here. No negativity. Okay, now I'm going to cark your... You can't hear me. Well, I can hear you. So you need to be nice. I know you can hear me, so don't try to do it. Yeah, I bet there is. Okay, so I wrote his name across the across this going into him. And now I'm going to turn it the other way, and I'm going to write your name over the top of his name. Okay, so I just, I just mushed you together, and I meshed you together, I should say meshed, I meshed you together on your candle, I meshed you together in your picture, and now um, your birthdays, your full names are meshed together in a candle. So now I'm going to go back this way, and I'm going to write all the things that I want so it's going into him, okay? Marriage, loyalty, love, happiness, sex. Ring, 
wedding. together forever. It's snowing outside. All right. The shop is so active tonight that I cannot believe there's not stuff on here just chatting me up. But I know that um, I know Lucifer is visiting because he likes to um, he likes to touch me and give me goosebumps like on my cheeks or my legs, and so I always can feel um, his energy makes me kind of anxious. And that's kind of a thing that he does so that I know it's him. It's like his own personal little, like when I get goosebumps, I know it's Lucifer. <laughs> and so he, that's, so he'll always like come and t he like, he'll do this with my cheeks and give me goosebumps just on my cheeks. And so I know it's him. It's, it's the thing he's, he's always done that to me. I don't know why, but it's just our little thing. <laughs> Do you like your new candles? Related. It's very, um, very good energy there, isn't it? Ooh. Let me cut this off so that I can have it set it aside. Okay, so now with your petition, and this is your picture that I meshed together. I'm going to go ahead and put some of your road opener herbs. Prosperity. It's very um, important to put prosperity herbs, especially in your in your marriage spells. Along with the along with the um, the love binding herbs and oils to open them up and all that good stuff. Wow. That's funny. Oh, All right, we're ready. Yeah, I'm going to put some. Oh, Lots of movement, huh? Can you tell me your name? So I'm putting the herbs on the apple on both sides. In the little stars. 
besides prosperity, open road, this side is love. Yes, I love to use the green apples for love spells. It's it's my own personal little favorite thing to do. Everybody else uses red. Now whenever I see um, other people doing the spell, they always use red. And I like to use the green ones because they're so pretty. Okay. I bind you to... You're bound to her. You're going to you marry her. She was your wife. Start a family with her. Marriage, happiness, love. You cherish her. You love her. She's the apple in your eye. There's no one more beautiful than her. She's the only one for you. You love her. At night when you sleep, you dream of her think of her all the time, all day, every day, you think of her. When you talk to people, you talk about her. When you're driving, you think of her. When you go out to eat, you see her. You, everything reminds you of her. She's your everything. Marriage, a wedding, love, happiness, propose, propose, Get married, get married, get married. I command you to get married. I command you to propose. I command you to commit to her in marriage. Ooh, can't find the other hand. Where did you go? There it is. I found it. <laughs> All right. Does not. Yeah, we're gonna get it together here. Does not. I seal your feet. As I tie this knot, your fate is sealed. So not a be. What's above? Not all of that good stuff. Isn't that beautiful? It's such a beautiful spell. I just love it. I just love it. It's so pretty. Okay, so now we're going to go ahead and dress your candle. So this is called dressing the candle. I'm going to put oil on it. My love potion oil, which is in here. Oh, I saw that. And then I'm going to put the herbs on it. And then I use a special wax um, to seal it to the apple. And then I, I let it burn and drip all over the apple and make a big mess. So I just saw him, you're like standing in like a kitchen area, and I just saw him like getting down on a knee and giving you a ring. Um, so you'll have to keep me posted and let me know if that happens.
Got a little carried away with the herbs. But that's okay. Isn't that pretty? Survive without my lighter. You gotta have fire to complete the spell. Classical. Mention classical, she's saying. Are you talking about the other version? There's always different versions of realities in the future because you don't know like which one they're going to choose. So, he's either going to do it in the kitchen, in the kitchen area, like there's like some kind of a bar right there, and then like the door, and then some kind of a doorway, and then like a, either a cabinet or a refrigerator right there, and then you're like turning this way, and he's like coming towards you. So either that way or in a restaurant. Those are the two versions I've seen, but first I've seen the kitchen area, so... Yeah. Are you? your name? There you go. That's what I like to hear. Man, this is giving me a hard time lately. Just keep trying until we get there. Oh, 
it's all the oils and the herbs on the bottom of the candle. Soften the wax up. Try again. I'm just going to hold it there then. The wax get hardened and then it will hold it better. So I'm not supposed to use the big candles. The little candles don't have a problem, they're super easy, but the big one, these tall ones are they're heavier, and so I think that's why they always fall over. But I like to use the tall ones. They do burn quite a bit longer too. Come on. I can still see like drippies over here. You can do it. Trust it. Ever. Ever. Forever. Are you going to stay? I don't trust it. It's not coming off. We'll just burn it. We'll just burn it and let it do what it's going to do. The wick is split into three already. All right, sweetheart, here is your spell. And I will sit here with it and put energy into it probably for about an hour and um, usually that lets it, it'll burn pretty fast and then tomorrow I will put a pink candle on it and then on the third day I will put a white candle on it um, yeah okay all right you guys that is it for tonight and then tomorrow night I will be doing biting bad behaviors and a booster so I have a ceremonial poppet one to do tomorrow. And um, I don't know if I'll show you that how I'm doing the poppet tomorrow because I just did a video on that. Um, because I have to say names and stuff with every stitch. And, and so I probably won't show that part on it. That's a big part of the spell. But... Um, I don't know. I'll have to, I'll figure out um, what part of the spell I want to videotape because it is a really beautiful spell. And, um, but like obviously the, the evoking of Biliel and the, um, that ceremonial part I will be showing, but I will be um, only showing that part to my client. And, um, But if you want to know how I do it, all you have to do is get the book, um, The Queen of Hell, Queen of Hell by Mark Allen Smith, and it's in the book exactly how I do it. Um, um, Belial likes it when I, Belial likes it when I use that book. So when I do that spell, I like to use that book. Um, he likes it. So. So that's how I do it now. Anyways, I didn't used to do it that way, but 
that's how I do it nowadays. It's very awesome. And I'm going to get off of here and get this video downloading. I think it, oh, it's stuck on there really good now. It just needed to harden up the wax. You know, it gets, you got to let it, let it do its thing. So it's good to go now. And I'm going to clean up my area and get everything switched around, put all my love stuff away and get everything switched around for tomorrow night. And then, um, and then we will go from there. Let's see. Talent. Manor Talent Certain Head. All right, you guys, I am out of here. I will see you tomorrow night. I'm really excited about tomorrow's ceremony. I always love it when I get to do, even though I know it's a really serious spell, um, and it makes me tired afterwards, like for the next couple of days, I'm really tired. But I, I need to keep practicing it and doing it until I learn how to master my energy is a little better um, and not that where it doesn't make me tired. But I don't know if there's any getting around that. I think that's just part of it. But uh, but I'm going to try to master that. But anyways, I love doing it because it gives me an excuse to call Belial because um, you guys know how I like to do that. Tonight I'm hanging out with Lucifer though. And then tomorrow I'll be hanging out with Belial and always hang out with Hecate every day, all day, every day. And, um, yeah. All right. Peace out, you guys. I'll talk to you later. Good night.